Good evening, everyone. I'm Dennis Flanagan. An honorary life membership is the highest honor that Landscape Ontario bestows. Since the inception of our association, only nine members have received this distinction. On behalf of Landscape Ontario, I am so proud to stand here tonight and announce to my dear friend, Mark Cullen, that he is the 10th member to be inducted into this exclusive club. Mark, Mark grew up in the profession. His father was an industry pioneer, and Mark has been enthusiastically sharing his passion for horticulture his entire life. Mark is a gifted communicator who has inspired thousands with his heartfelt and trusted advice. However, what really sets Mark apart is his integrity and his eagerness to contribute. He's on numerous committees and boards. He has given thousands of volunteer hours helping to make Landscape Ontario, Canada Blooms, and the profession better. He has represented Landscape Ontario at the Vineland Research and Innovation Centre. And since he is a respected and much sought after speaker, Landscape Ontario has used Mark repeatedly to deliver our messages and he's never ever let us down. As soon as you meet Mark, you quickly see what a humble yet inspiring person he is. Recently, Mark founded an organization called the Highway of Heroes Living Tribute. The goal... Yes, right. The goal is to plant 117,000 trees along the Highway of Heroes right of way from Trenton to Toronto, one tree for every member of our military who has sacrificed your life for our country. The secondary goal is to plant two million trees adjacent to the highway. This is an incredible project, and it's because of Mark's effective use of public profile and his inspirational manner that this idea has taken root. Two uh, years ago, Mark and his wife Mary issued a scholarship challenge to the profession. They contributed $30,000 per year and asked others to consider giving what they could in order to support horticultural students. Based on the challenge, the Ontario Horticultural Foundation was able to give out $70,000 in scholarships last year. And as you've just seen this evening, $50,000 this year. Mark was recently awarded the Order of Canada for his contributions to horticulture. As a result, our entire profession was elevated when he received this honor because in essence, it reflects back on all of us. Mark, uh, it's because of your generosity, contribution, ethic, enthusiasm for others, passion, positive energy, exemplary character, nurturing spirit, ability to inspire people about horticulture, and a sense of mission that you are receiving the award tonight. I'm grateful to call you a friend, and I know a few other people that are coming up on stage that are pretty proud of you too. I... Thank you. A standing ovation well deserved. 
We're just going to ask Mark to uh, say, a, say a few words, if he wouldn't mind. Okay. All right. Um, my wife will say he's never speechless. <laughs> Mary, um, kids, mem members of Lansing Ontario, Tony, Dennis, My father had a favorite poem. It went, flowers on my neighbor's vine are his, but they are also mine. His the cost and his the labor too, but mine the loveliest of you, loveliness to you. This award, this honor is not mine alone. It's mine, but it's mine to share. It's mine to share with you, members of Landscape Ontario, and to acknowledge this evening the great work that we all do together in the original green <laughs> profession. We all do it together. It's ours to share. The labor is ours to share. The joy is ours to share. And I'm so thankful that I'm able to share it with my family this evening. Thank you, and God bless you all. <laughs>